Hello. JPEG tuber Jade here. <laughs> I uh, can't be bothered, but also want to play this game, so. Oh, look at that. My coffee is slightly invisible. <laughs> Hi, Shay. Thank you for the hydrate, Nick. I assure you I am. But hello to Teeny. Nick, well done on View of the First. And hello, Keenan. I don't know if they if if uh, Tom Jones did the did the cover, but yeah. So this is a very chill stream because I just feel like playing this game. Oh, hello, cat. Yeah, I just don't know. I just feel like playing this game, but don't really feel like being seen. <laughs> so I'm going to be floating here with my, my tea or my coffee or whatever it is. Yeah. <clears throat> so. All the things happening. Right, let's uh, water in the middle and then I think there's a chance it'll water either side as well. Yeah, look at that. Min maxing. I let my lemons. Hail ye. So look at that. And then we'll go and say hi to Kat as well. Keenan. Ads? There shouldn't be ads. What we're all thinking of me. Yes, do say hello to me. And that we will yeah, exactly. That's why that's why I'm doing it. Hello cat. Oh, it's Typhoon. Hello, Typhoon. But if you're in the mood for chill, cosy, very slippy vibes, you're in the right place. I, uh, <clears throat> I don't know. I might be going to some kind of social event tomorrow that I've just forgot forgotten about until just now. So hopefully, a stream yesterday and a stream today will uh, make up for that fact. Also, I'm just like really, really addicted to this game, so. Hello, Sophia. There's no game audio. My screen's just turned off. What is happening? I thought there was something missing. Uh, just give me a second. What happens when I stream outside of the uh, usual... Yeah, my screen's just turned off. I don't know what happened. 
Can you hear it now? There should be like slight bird noises. Okay, I don't know. I don't I genuinely don't know what I did. <laughs> I've no idea why you got ads by the way, Shay. I'm sorry about that. They should be off. Deliver some wood to Thomas, right? I don't know why. I can't. I don't. I don't recall why. No, but yeah. Don't sit, Shiva, but I wanted to give you this anyway. Thank you, Sophia. As a community, it's our job to come and lift you up in your time of mourning. Well, there we go. I've got lots of wood for you. Oh, lovely. Uh, would you be a dear and run it over to Thomas, though? He is assembling the bonfire. Imagine being so rude to reject my wood. You guys wouldn't reject my wood, would you? <laughs> Hello, I'm the new rancher, Marty. Mayor Soft tells me I have to you to thank for my new home. Do you come by anytime and say hello? I have something for you. I honestly thought that this ranch was going to be mine. Wait, so I'm not fixing this ranch? I wasn't fixing this ranch all along? Oh my gosh, what? What is this? What is this? Fully agree with that quote. Just coming out here rejecting my wood. Who do you think you are? I won't stand for it. No, that's a strange quote from Keenan. I didn't mean to chop that wood. Oh, oh, I meant to pick this thing up. Yeah, the building to the left is mine. I do, I realise, but it's kind of... I just... I, I was... Maybe it's my own fault, but I thought that's what I was uh, given all the materials to have repaired. Oh boy, was I wrong. Gotta go cook, sorry. Well, thanks for stopping by, Nick. I hope you have a wonderful evening. Where is the ranch, then? Very good question. I have my suspicions. We'll go and find out in a second. Hello, Tom. Thomas. Here is some wood. The wood for the bonfire, Thomas. Thanks. It's really nice of you to help Sophia out. If that's bait, wash ashore, I'm not biting. Well, nice talking to you, Thomas. Wait. I... Ugh. Need a favor. How can I help? The summer festival is meant to celebrate the bounty of Fairhaven. Sophia and Angus spend the whole week leading up to it cooking and baking. Sophia asked me if I'd help her with the corn for popcorn. I filled up as many of my plots as I can spare, but it won't be enough. You need me to grow corn? Yep. Oh, I'm already growing seeds. corn. Five bushels ought to do it. Oh, for God's sake. Are you serious? You're giving me corn seeds? I've already bought some. Oh. So. Were you and Lena ever... Oh. Hazel told you about my high school dating life? That was a long time ago. And she moved on. Parker, he's a stand-up guy. But did you move on? Sure. Alright. So yeah, here we go. Oh, look at the animals! Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, I don't like him already. Whoa. This ranch is incredible. I'm Marty Mu Emerson. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you, uh, Mr. Emerson. No, oh, please. Just call me Marty. I want you to know that the ranch you help rebuild is in good hands. Oh, I, I didn't. I don't know. Really 
I've graduated with honors from the top national course in animal husbandry. Mm -hmm. Is that, uh, can we still call it that? I mean, you're a farmer too. And you're a girl. Oh, no. Maybe it should be animal spousedry. Huh? I don't think... Duh. This is already more complicated than I thought. Is it, though? Yeah, maybe we should start by keeping things simple. For now, you can buy eggs from me. When you're ready to raise... You just gave me chicks, six eggs. I can sell you some chicks, too. You'll want to build a coop to keep them from scampering off. <laughs> uh, that one the hard way. Uh, that nice carpenter fellow, Parker, can help you out. Okay, so I need money and wood to make a coop. Okay. Oh, epic! epic. <gasps> look at the animals. Oh, look at them. I feel like I'm on that that bit of Nintendo when you like go and say hello to all of them, and you have to choose one. I can't pet any of them. Oh, hang on. No, I can't. I'm petting them in my in my head. Look at you. Oh, the cows. They're so cute. Big fan. Zero out of ten unplayable. I fully agree. Do you have an updated axe? I have I don't know how to check. Uh tools? I have a copper axe. Currently. Do need to do some mining. I guess I need to do some wood chopping as well. Hey, you come back here. Where is he off to? I'm fully suspicious of him. No, don't you dare look down on me. What's this? Had any luck with building that coop? Once you do, I'll be able to sell you some chicks. I don't know. I guess that's kind of a green flag that you won't sell me them despite not having any where to keep them. I'd say that's firmly a green flag. My pa used to love the summer festival. He sounds like a fun guy. Well, yeah, he ate a mushroom. In the black every year. <laughs> Folks in Fairhaven can put away a lot of weed ale on a hot summer night. Oh, I'm just... Really funny. How's it going, Lena? How's it going? Is her name Vanessa? Yeah. Last year, the Fairhaven Summer Festival <laughs> was included on a list of the best summer activities in the region. Of course, we were at the bottom of the list, but maybe now that you're here, we'll be at the top. You are a lifesaver. Now the twins have something to occupy themselves with outside of school. Except, Emmy keeps asking me about stock options, and Finn? Keeps asking, what would happen if you put ketchup in lemonade? Classic. Uh, I'm gonna just keep selling stuff to her. Guess. To make sure that we have unlocked everything. Oh, look at that. You get loads for... There we go. Fennel seeds. Alright, we've got one more star to... To sell. <clears throat> to, to sell up to. I don't know how to word that. <laughs> yeah. Finn's a scientist, clearly, and a connoisseur. Ketchup lemonade might be the next best thing. My grandpa passed back in Kauai. It was kind of sudden. I didn't get a chance to be with him like you did with Hazel. That's really rough, Kai. I'm sorry. Nah, I'm not complaining. I'm just psyched you did get to say goodbye. Oh, that's emotional intelligence, that. <laughs> hey. 
have you been finding your time in Fairhaven restorative? I can tell another city-weary soul when I see one. It's been great so far. A lot of work, but great. So, tell me. I imagine you must have had many admirers back home. Did you leave anyone special behind when you left? Honestly, no one I dated in the city is as special as they all seem to think they are. I find people here fully flirting. Interesting. Like you. <laughs> That's a lot to live up to. But you'll That wasn't flirting. To a challenge. I fully meant it as a flirt. That there are quite a few people the heck? in town who would like to get to know you better. I might have to fight them off to get some time with you. <laughs> she flirted back. Oh, I just sold all my bananas. I'm so stupid. I'm delighted to learn there is a summer festival in Fairhaven when I first moved here. There's one back home called Tiergran, the Festival of Rain. My family didn't really observe it, but my friend's family did. Her mom made the most amazing saffron rice pudding every year. Right. Well, I feel silly. Ugh. <sighs> Go and see Violet. <laughs> yep, that far indeed. Counselor. He was really close with Grandma, huh? I think so, yeah. But not like that. Ew! Ew! Hey, if they were close like that, good for Hazel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello, Angus. You have a quest? I like Violet. <laughs> it's great that Thomas is helping out with the summer festival snacks this year. He usually grumbles anytime someone brings up the summer festival. I wonder what made him change his mind. Hey, I've heard you're helping with the summer festival. <laughs> Word gets around quickly in this town, doesn't it? Every summer, I make my giant strawberry shortcake for the whole town. It's my own personal mission to make it bigger every year. One day, I'll beat the world record. I need strawberries. Heaps and heaps of Are you gonna ask me to grow strawberries? So awesome if you could spare some. Oh, I hope my flower delivery comes in time. Oh my goodness. Right. Uh so go and say hey to Francis and when then I think summer festival. Gosh, we're, everyone's talking about it. Fried food, someone blasting reggaeton out of a window, ya tu sabe. And most importantly, space for me to set up a cute little stall with my latest jewelry designs. But you know, Fairhaven's version is fine too. Right, let's see if I can go and squeeze any more stuff in. Oh, I know what I was going to do. Hello. I would like to buy. Oh no, I, oh no, no, no. What I was going to do is I was going to buy 12, 12 of these from him and then come back and do that. Haha. -ha. That is what I was doing. Francis! I require your services. I don't think it's actually that expensive. No, it's not really. Shall I just... I've done it. <clears throat> I've done it. Yeah, there will be no flower delivery as it has been all made into fish fingers. There's a, a high demand for fish fingers. Have I got any fish fingers on me? I have. So I've got like cash literally sat in my pocket, you know. Right, I need wood. Okay, let's go get the wood. Casually drop in a few thousand like it's nothing. What can I say? Single-handedly keeping the economy of Fairhaven alive. Oh, finally. Do, 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 do. I'll chop another one of these just for... Just 
just for safety. Your game is quiet. Uh, have I got the music turned really down? I probably have. Uh, turn it up. There we go. Hopefully that's a little better. Basically privatised quantitative easing at, the, at that point. Goodness gracious, Keenan. Hi, Natalia. Oh, it's a perfect day. Gosh, if I weren't working, I'd put on a bikini and head down to the beach. One thing I love about Fairhaven is that nobody tells me bikinis aren't for me, which I got in the city sometimes. That is messed up. And plain wrong. I may be unlucky in love, but I look great in nylon spandex. <laughs> I did the thing. <laughs> For now, if I do this, bam! Oh, <laughs> speed of that! Do I just chop it down in one swoop? Oh, look at that. Absolute speedy. All my wood needs. Sorted. Finally. Don't know why she's shouting finally every time. happy to have chopped down a tree it's like yeah deforestation how quick does this happen whoa what's this a recipe hell yeah i mean a recipe for fruit salad are we joking It's like the first lesson of food tech in school. Yeah. Right, I've cleared out this area. Which is good. I do need to put some... Yeah, ours is the same. So predictable. <laughs> right, I need to build... I need to sacrifice some of my soil and build a couple more of these. Uh, which is bad, but hopefully long-term gains. Because eventually this little area is going to be completely dedicated to flowers. My plan anyway. So, right. Uh, what did I need? I needed strawberries, didn't I? Let's grow some strawberries. And then I think I would ne also needed loads of corn as well, so let's chuck some more of that down. There we go. Right, I'm just going to go over my little to-do list here. Cut up fruit, put in orange juice, done. <laughs> it wasn't even that nice though. I don't think I've ever made it since. I never wake up one morning, I'm like, you know what, I'm going to chop up some fruit and chuck some orange juice in with it. Why? Why would I do that? You're like halfway to a smoothie, you might as well blend it into a smoothie at that point. So yeah, I need strawberry. Oh, I need to go and tell Sophia that I've dropped the wood off. Yeah, I need corn. Oh, I haven't planted cotton. Oh, okay. Uh, did I even, did he even give me cotton seeds? I don't think he did. You want me to plant cotton, but with what, friend? With what? If you're tired of refilling your watering can, have to, uh, uh, okay. Um. But yeah, hopefully all of my upgrades will make all this much easier. 
Do I need to go and buy the cotton seeds? I might have to. Let's go and see. Just pop past here a second again, just to check. Yeah, I don't, there's nothing else I can unlock here. So I have, I think I have got everything so far that I can get. Oh, Bruno is open. Are you growing cotton? No. I've been asked to grow cotton though. I haven't been given any seeds for it. Or am I am I an idiot? <laughs> it doesn't even look like I'd be able to unlock them. Oh, maybe I am growing it. I can't remember. I can't remember. I can't remember planting it. Maybe I did plant it. Mom said it would be good for me to go to the beach since it's so nice out. But what would I do? Like sit on a towel and stare at the water? Oh, I buy them from Thomas. Right, okay. I think I did plant some. If I'm remembering correctly. Do I sink another two grand into tuna? Let's go and have a look around the forest. Woke up after the fields were planted. Oh, he's so sauce. I don't like him. Don't like him. No. Hey, Kim. Wesley, that bookseller from Milkwater is my biggest customer these days. What does he do with all that meat? Does he like feed an orphanage? A carnivorous orphanage? I don't know. But now you've said it, I feel a little bit worried. <laughs> oh, you have a quest for me too. Oh, is it just the... Oh wait, no. Oh my gosh. Hi, Parker. Chopping down some wood? No. I've been coming by the woods every so often to see if my favorite flowering tree is Not yet, Typhoon. Yet. When I was a kid in the city, there was only one tree on our block in front of my neighbor Miss Lovitz's house. It used to bloom pink petals once a year. It was like a miracle on that drab block. I gotta say, I don't miss that concrete jungle at all. I used to dream of Grandma's farm, I guess. I can relate. I feel like when I was a kid, I used to dream all year of getting to come to Grandma's farm in the summer. <laughs> you were a lucky kid to get that break in nature. I've only ever heard good things about your grandpa, too. I bet it was nice having that time with him. I went back home one winter, and Miss Lovitz's house was gone and replaced by a new condo building. They took the tree out, too. See, in winter, it didn't look like much, just some spindly branches. But nothing can be in full bloom all the time, can it? Otherwise, you wouldn't appreciate it. I guess that's true. Take it easy, Tara. <laughs> Oh, hello, Angel. I am inde indeed streaming for the second day in a row. How was your stream, by the way? I had very nice foods, thank you, by the way. Hello, Shelby. Your grandma knew you would come back to take care of her in the end. She did? Oh, yeah. I told her. I don't get it. <laughs> nah. You sure don't. Shelby's definitely the farce here. Absolutely certain of it. So that's a farce here thing to say. Totally. Right. I'm gonna go back. Nice food, it was a nice stream. I think I have been cured of my Power World addiction. I should celebrate by playing some Power World. <laughs> I think, yes. Absolutely. I am 
I'm completely on board with this plan. I mean, it sounds flawless. If you ask me. So who are you going to marry in Stardew? Or are you already married? Are you going to marry, marry that Yisabel person? Now these witches are just being brazen. Brazen? Brazen? I don't know. Words. Collateral. Oh, why have I reminded myself of that word again? Oh, hello, Sophia. I gave Thomas the wood you needed. Oh, lovely. Here, this is fresh out of the oven. You deserve it. What just keeps giving me food? I guess thanks, but like... Damn. Oh, this is the bonfire. It's like, it said like Ray. Brazen. Look at me. So good at pronunciation. That's it. Thank you, Typhoon. Isabella's a cutie and Kiara's a cute. Kiara is cute, so it's Sophia. Abigail is always a classic. I guess I'll marry them all. I bet there's a mod for that. Having a massive polyamorous marriage. In fact, I'm I'm I would be disappointed in the community if a mod didn't exist for that. Let's go and see if I had I had any cotton planted over here. I always forget I can jump over this. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I can mix four. Yeah, there we go. We move. We move in. How many cotton did I need? Six. I think I needed six, didn't I, as well? Oh, no, I only needed four. So I'll have four to myself. Let's have a go at this. I think I have a shovel now. Lay. Well, <laughs> I don't know what I haven't got on this level. Oh, is it mushrooms? Hey, there we go. Shiitake mushroom. All right, I can now thankfully guiltlessly run to go on to the next level. <laughs> so how fast is it at mining these like special blocks? Oh, instant. Brilliant. Perfect. Wonderful. Is this a Stardew Valley S game, but with witches? I mean, I guess so, actually. I guess something that's different with Stardew in this game is that there's no monsters in the mine, which for uh, somebody who's a massive horse like me, big fan of. And also, there's no old people murdering it, Angel, did they lie? Uh, <laughs> but also the, the fishing is a lot easier in this game. And there's even like a toggle. Like, it's so accessible, like, you can remove timing challenge when fishing. I don't know if you can see it, but it's there. And you can change the day speed, so you can have it, like, how I've got it, or whatever. <clears throat> it just feels a lot more accessible to me. And the story is also just wonderful. It's 
okay, Jade. I can keep a secret, especially when my life is threatened to keep that secret. <laughs> okay, good. I'm glad we have an arrangement. <laughs> Yeah, ne never met him. Never met him. I do love the witchy vibes. Am I gonna get the key? I'm gonna run out of energy. Gosh, I thought this would be like... A breeze. Now that I have the upgraded stuff. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. One sec. Actually got to the button in time on my Steam stream deck. Crazy. Ever think Steam came out with their Steam deck? I always call my stream deck a Steam deck. And then think, wait, is that right? And then I'll like correct myself twice. I'm gonna eat some cake or something. I've, I've got so much food in my inventory. Give me that chocolate cupcake. Mm. Damn. Oh, I bought some brownie flavored Oreos today. I haven't tried them yet. But they just sounded extremely nice. I will let you know. How they are. When I eat them. <laughs> That's because Jade buried her behind the farmhouse. That's where she's going to bury us if we don't keep the secret. I'm never going to find the key. This is it. This is just the end. This is the end of the mine. Oh, like there we go. To the next level. Okay, we're, we're not being dramatic anymore. <laughs> Where's the key to this chest, though? Maybe I can find it. Maybe we carry on. It was hard trying to talk to people about all the games I wanted to play on my Steam Deck and the utter confusion they'd have confused how you could play a game on the Stream Deck. Like, it's genuinely a real issue I have. <laughs> I have... I have such... I don't know. I already have, like, basically half a speech impediment. You know what I mean? Like, I don't, I don't need these two products that I reasonably probably will discuss quite regularly I'm honestly so inconsiderate of steam and valve also another thing that was inconsiderate of steam and valve is when typhoon bought steam deck and then they came out with a new Fantastic, fabulous, shiny version. Like the day after or something silly. Was it like the day after? I can't remember. Don't forget the Steam Dock for your Steam Deck, which you can control with your Stream Deck. It was the next month. <laughs> yeah, it was something like that. It was something silly. Cute emote. Jade the three Toby. Have I cleared out this place? Oh no, there's this. The key's gotta be somewhere. I saw Toby at the weekend. I really have no idea how he's gonna react to moving house because my parents are moving. It's going to be so bizarre for him because we're going to take him while they do all the moving stuff and then he's just going to 
get brought back to another place and never go back to the other place and they'll it'll just be constantly wondering when when are we going back and they won't be he'll probably struggle at first but he'll adapt he'll be okay oh yeah i'm, I'm sure he will i think he's more of a people person rather than a police person i think he like has his little spots but he has his spots here now too like in our house as long as he's near us I like to think that it doesn't really matter to him. There's honestly no key. Hello? Mm. Wow. Have I missed somewhere? I like open these. Uh Well alright then. Typhoon, that is just his everyday That's just how he is. That's his face. That's his default mood. He's concerned. I don't know what I can do with Amethyst. Have a look at it. Oh, another thing that's really nice in this game, Angel, is that just infinite inventory space. <laughs> I have never felt so relaxed. <laughs> right, what am I what am I looking for? Amethyst. Can be crafted into jewellery or used as a magical ingredient. Very nice. I think of a single game that doesn't have limited space infinite inventory should become a trend it should it really should i i love it i don't know if you've seen i don't know if you've been here when i've been playing uh, another game that's that feels very non-stressy as well but i played i've played a bit of faith arm that has a limited inventory space but it doesn't feel like you're rushed on anything. At least I've not actually encountered anything yet that makes me feel rushed. So honestly, I can jump in between these two games a bit. Um, oh, oh, all that strength, right. I'm not gonna carry on. I think that's a good time to head back. Inventory limits definitely feels like an old design choice that needs to die, at least in games like this. Yeah. I mean, I understand it up to a point, but I just feel so... I feel like this game understands me. <laughs> I'm gonna go into the super secret basement and see what we need to make the thingy that we need to give to the far seer so let me it's here that i need to do it and yeah so some paper some black ink and some beeswax Ooh, i have the beeswax already i can't remember uh i think uh oh heck oh heck i can make flour sorry uh <laughs> Can I? Yeah. Okay. I think I did get. I already have a cauldron. It, I swear, like it tried to tell me that I'd unlocked the cauldron when Grandma died, but no, I haven't. I just. Oh, hi, Johnny. How you doing? Uh, what am I doing? Actually, oh, 
this the shed over here, isn't there? That has the stuff in it. Yes, paper. Haha. -ha. How many paper did I need? I'll make two, just for safety. Okay. And then how do I make ink? <laughs> uh it would be very good if I knew how to do that. I can't remember where to get it from. It may be a Google. My journal say. Uh, it was something in the basement, I remember that much. Make ink? Google, what's that? I only use Yahoo Answers. Oh. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. Ah, ha, ha, ha. So I can make it. That's perfect. There we go. So now I need to give it to the farseer during the daytime. I'm pretty convinced it's Shelby. Part of me doesn't want to have to do that. I have to do it again, though. Or suffer the negative consequences. I'm really worried. Comfy Jade, yes! How are you doing, Wintors? Hey, hey! That is also the 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 noise I make upon Wintors entering. Wintors, that's just me and you just That's me and you right now. Existence is pain. I know, like, isn't it such a scam, like, that every day we have to wake up and live? You know what I mean? Hundred percent, hundred percent. Oh, my magic look has gone down because I used my magicka. Yeah, like, is Keenan going to do the line? <laughs> he is, yeah. <laughs> There it is. Me, me, me and Typhoon have got Keenan figured out. Absolutely figured out. <laughs> Am right. I ready for bed? Always. Yeah, Keenan's doing pure lines. He's changed a lot in the last few days. Oh heck, it's Sunday. I do feel it too. So it's either this or a dead touch. <laughs> Hi, Parker. How's it going? No, it's definitely not you. Morning, Parker. Morning. Can I help you with something? Well, yes, actually. Natalia told me all about the great job you did on the mine, and you know that broken bridge over yonder. Uh huh. What'll it be? Well, some more wood and some iron from your mine would shore up the supports. The mayor's excited because a scientist with a big research grant wants to move into the old lookout post. But I just want to take walks up the mountain pass again and visit my favorite flowering dogwood trees. Okay, I'll help. Thanks. You can bring the supplies by my shop when you're ready. He says it like it's my privilege. Oh, you can. I saw that Violet's selling marigold seeds now that summer started. Did you know that marigolds scare off pests? Something about the way they taste, I guess. So, don't eat any. All right. Bye, Parker. Ha ha. Oh, hello, cake. I need to send Keen into rehab. I know. Getting out of hand. Keenan, please. And now nah, you're not you're not that two dimensional. I don't want help. We're fine. I'm gonna go say hey to the cat. 
Hey, cat. Cat, if you're still here, hi, cat. Ban Keenan. <laughs> Cake's been here 10 seconds. He's calling for a ban of Keenan. Oh, thanks for the chub, kitty. Kitty cat. Kitty, kitty, kitty cat. Oh. Hello, fats. Classic way to enter my stream, honestly. Just come in, just... Freaking let it rip. It's the true relaxation. Oh. This is what this is what I strive to achieve. Yeah, you are. Don't let anyone don't let anyone believe anything else. Wow, Kat didn't even say hi to me because she hates me. Wow. I I do care, Wintors. That's why I sit here with my tea. You with your your sippy your sippy cup of your beverage of choice. And we just you know we just chill together. This is why Wintors and I don't leave their house. I'm at work, okay? I don't have chat open. Wintors is upset that you didn't say hi to him, okay? Hi, cat, by the way. No leave house. This is why Paramore won two Grammys without even leaving the house. Where the heck is Shelby? What on earth? Shelby. I have your silly incantation and you ain't even where I hope you'd be. <laughs> Outside is bad. The heck is the farseer? Oh, that is one big high for the Wintors. Hello. Whoa, Cake, whoa. What, are you coming and left? Rude. Hi, Angus. Anyone seen that bird on TikTok that's called Angus? I thought a new Angus, McMangus. Marty sure seems to have time to spare. He hangs out in front of my croissant display and snaps so many photos. Says they do well on social. I can't argue with that. I had num nums, now I have a post for sleep. Hope to get food dreams. Bye bye, Jade. I leave a look. Thank you, Angel. I appreciate it. I hope you I hope you have a good post. Post uh post food slut. Hello, Maya. Otter. It's nice that school is out and I get Vanessa to myself for uh, Angel's she really Angel's fine so in his sleep. Oh, oh dear. To those children, even the ones who are a bit more difficult. I have interrupted my emotes to say I hate their accents, that is all. Oh. I'm sorry, Cake. Night, 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 Angel. I just love feeling the summer sun on my skin. It's an all-natural mood enhancer. Nothing like the sun in Los Angeles. Thank you for the loop. Thankfully, that light is merciless. Could you imagine if it's it? Could you imagine if I thought it was him? Like, yeah. Wow. Oh. Ain't no mountain high enough to keep me from reaching the pinnacle. Go with logic in your minds and your Ain't eyes no on the path. Ain't no mountain high enough. I didn't mean to like listen to that. I didn't. I don't agree with this. Eight no bad in the winter. Tarts, it's hard to resist buying them all. I wonder if I could get him to try that new plant-based zero-calorie sugar sweetener I read about. Why don't you just eat sugar every now and then? <laughs> you know, I'm not sure. I'd probably be fine if I did eat some. It just feels wrong. <laughs> To keep me away from you, baby. <clears throat> Could you imagine if Cameron's entire religion was just based on lyrics from that song? So, Thomas is the one making the bonfire for the summer festival, huh? I hope he studied the correct fuel placement. You messed that up. It's the consciousness center. Instead of roaring flames. 
All right, I think I've talked to everybody in there. Now, where the heck is Shelby? Some people in here. Oh, I can sell my fish fingers. Hi, Sophia. Every time Juliet complains that she's bored, I just ask her to help me prep something for the summer festival. And magically, she's hardly ever bored anymore. <laughs> I would like to sell my 100 fish fingers to you. Here we go. Hello, Damon. So, Damon, why did your folks decide to move here? I was starting kindergarten, and well, they thought it'd be better to start fresh somewhere new. I guess they just felt drawn to this place, like you. Reckon he's a wizard. When I was little, all the kids wore flower crowns to the summer festival. It was super cute. You should see pictures of me. But I'm kind of glad we're not doing it anymore. I don't have to attach flowers to those stupid wire frames that never hold together. I need to go and find Shelby. Goodness gracious. Hi, Kim. What's up? I seem distracted. Ah, don't mind me. Just looking at flights to Japan. You're planning a visit? Take me! Not actively planning. I just haven't been back in 10 years. Wouldn't mind seeing all my cousins again. What a demand! Take me! Like, flights to Japan t take, like, cost nothing. I mean, I I'm sure I'd be able to foot the bill, you know, but it's fine. <laughs> anyway. There's a, a little ad coming soon, so I, I'm going to take a little break and go and refill my water. My water. So I'll be right back. Ahem. Hello. Oh, managed to go to the toilet, refill my drink, and also get a cherry liqueur still left over from Christmas, so... I'm going to eat that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, Wintour's, I hope you feel okay. It got a little bit spicy in here, real quick. I'll, I'll open a window. Why is it spicy? Because you're all farting. You're also gassy. and zoom into the shop oh when i was a kid i used to go visit my cousins at the beginning of every summer for the zoom. shinyo lantern floating ceremony we'd write messages on lanterns and then push them <laughs> into the water he's never gonna it come back sick. typhoon i asked Otto if we could do that here but he said there wasn't room in the budget uh, whatever and see if Shelby has returned to his usual spot -a <gasps> Hello, Amira. Marty Emerson came by my clinic asking for antihistamines. Strange that a man who is allergic to animals would choose to open a ranch. Judging by the bite on his hand, <laughs> I better keep plenty of antibiotics in stock, too. I like him, Amira. He is strange. He is very strange. Is he there? Oh, he is. Hi, Lena. Oh, maybe he's a witch hunter. Oh, my gosh. That she met Robert at the summer festival. The teenagers used to challenge each other to jump over the bonfire. Oh. Uh. Robert waited until it was stacked really high, and then he took the biggest leap. And he cleared it? Oh my god, what no. if he is Typhoon? I'm worried. His pants caught fire, and Hazel dumped her lemonade on him to put it out. <laughs> ah, it was the beginning of a great love story. Right, let's go and see if we're right. Oh, don't be a perfectionist, Jade. 
Trust your instincts. Let's chat with him first. I've lost more loved ones than I care to speak about. I still see them sometimes, though. Oh, you mean like in dreams? Sure. Here we go. Am I sure this is the Farseer witch? I'll have to make another incantation and explain myself if I'm wrong. I'm certain. Here you go, Shelby. That's fine. You keep it. You'll need it. So I passed? You Hell always yeah. always gonna pass. Now go on, don't want folks getting too curious. <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm amazing. Look at me. Being epic. I'm a pro gamer. Pro gamer. Right here. You ever seen such pro gamerism in all your days? Cause I haven't. Very legitimate quote to come up then. To Typhoon, I mean. Everybody do, does love a very cute. Oh, I was in the. Um, uh, I went to Meadow Hall recently, and I went in the Build Bear, and they had the, the hairy kill. One that they're doing in there, and I, sh I just I thought of you. It's so cute. When I think Jade the first, I think Jade the pro gamer, and right you are, right you are. Yeah, basically synonyms. I mean, you look at pro gamer, you see Jade the first in the in the Oxford Dictionary. So, I was hoping for one of them. <laughs> Fair enough. Jade's first because they are the best. Exactly. Someone gets it. need for the coop? Is it just wood? What's a Parker about building a coop for the chickens? I feel like that's quite a high priority request actually. I don't know where he'll be. I think he'll be at the consciousness center maybe. Let's go and check by the Sunday in it. Freaking Sunday! Ah, there he is. No. Probably have to ask him while he's at work. Let's go and see Grandma. Hi, Grandma. I was wondering if I can re-put in some... some flowers. Is the map updated? Aha, so... I think if we repair the bridge we can go up to this area, which I believe, I believe, is where Wesley lives. I'm not entirely sure. I'm kind of impressed with myself for avoiding most of the spoilers of this game. Other than the obvious one. But we're past that now. We're past that. Oh, hello, Francis. You could buy Keenan a wife. You know what I didn't expect to love here? Fireflies. Nothing better than a warm summer night, holding hands with your fiance and watching the fireflies. Ouch. I sorry, Tara. I forgot about your garbage ex. Just rude. It's 
see if any more bananas have spawned, seeing as I was rude enough to sell all of mine. Oh, hello, Bruno. That new rancher fella wrinkles his nose every time he walks by my stall. If he can't handle the scent of a good fresh catch, how does he handle his own bun? Very suspicious. Very suspicious. Everyone's very suspicious of him. I'm glad it's not just me. Because I, I did feel kind of like a bad person when I immediately judged them. Exactly that emote, actually. Wintors. Let's go and say hi to Thomas. Hello. My dad helped out with the summer festival once. He never did it again. Said it was too much work for a middling party. What's this? I have so many missions on with, with Thomas at the moment. What can I buy from you? I can buy recipes for vegetarians and cotton seeds. Yeah. Interesting. Hello. Hi, Juliet. Are you helping your mom out with summer festival prep? Nah, only because she asked me to. Big parties are not my thing. I do like the legend, though. I wish more stuff like that happened these days. All right. Let's hit the mine. I think I need iron for a lot of stuff. I need sugar for that. I need silver for that, so. Yeah, I need iron ingots for that. Iron ingots for that. <clears throat> Just a lot of iron ingots. Wait, hold on. He gave me one strawberry seed. Just gonna double check how many I get. Makes four? Oh gosh. I'm not gonna have enough. He needs six. The heck is this? Uh, I can buy strawberry seeds from her in the general store. Oh, but I don't have space to grow them. <laughs> Ah, uh, stress. How long are these going to take? These are taking six days. Corn is taking four days. Well, hopefully, oh, I don't, I, I don't actually, ha I have no corn growing. I haven't got enough corn growing either. Oh, and I've got how many days until the festival? Twelve. Oh. I don't have enough. This is silly. Ridiculous. Ridiculous and silly and silly and ridiculous. Can't buy your way out of this problem exactly. I should have. Should have been better. I mean, I've, ha I've had a severe lapse in judgment. Not with that attitude. I mean, I, I, I don't know. Can I buy strawberries somewhere? I mean, I probably just need to wait for something to grow and then harvest it and then grow more. Or remember to grow what I need, I guess, is the issue. Do 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 do
Has anyone watched the Percy Jackson series? It's all out now. So. Very binge worthy. I watched them as they came out and as the books were something that, you know, still mean a lot to me. I very much enjoyed it. <laughs> Trying to watch Lucifer. Oh, I got obsessed with that show. <clears throat> but I didn't like it when it moved. I, I didn't like it when it moved over to Netflix. I haven't watched it much of it when it's the, the Netflix stuff. I think, was it, was it originally on Prime? I can't remember. Yeah. I watched it when I was quite young and I think I was just like literally watching it just because I was obsessed with um, the, the, the relationship with the Lucifer and Chloe. Is it Chloe? Chloe Decker? I was obsessed with that. I don't know, I was obsessed with all the characters. I think the characters are just really good. I don't remember a single storyline. Oh, I do, oh, I remember the fact that the um, her therapist has a baby with Lucifer's brother, right? Or something? I'm in a deal. Yeah, 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 I'm in a deal. It was decent but sliding on Prime once it went over to Netflix. It just seemed to stop trying. Exactly. That's how I felt. I like a men deal, but he's banging him. To the next level. Exactly. Oh, is that silver? Oh, silver. Oh. Lovely, lovely, jubbly. Wintors isn't that far through. Oh, heck, sorry. That doesn't actually happen. I'm just, I'm just actually uh, making stuff up. I'm making stuff up, Wintors. I'm, I'm making stuff up. Uh, uh, doesn't actually happen. <laughs> what do you mean? This is a spoiler free zone. Right, I'm gonna carry on in hopes that I'll get more silver ore. I don't know where I got the silver ore from. Was it from one of these blocks or was it from one of the like these looking blocks? I don't know. Getting a heckin' lot of copper though. <gasps> Silver! I don't know how much you need. I can never remember how much ore you need to make an ingot. But look! It has the stuff. I didn't know I could do this. Woo! <clears throat> But yeah, I don't know. It is certainly not a bad show. I think it does some interesting stuff with the concept that they're playing with, but yeah. If you're not into that, like, will they, won't they storyline. There really isn't much there for you. <laughs> I bought a new book today and it wasn't even the one that I said I was going to buy on my uh I could on my uh threads and do I feel bad about it no
I really, really, really do need to get through some of my <laughs> books I haven't yet read. She's still in here as a resident. That is so sad. <clears throat> I'm going to head over to the coven and see if there's any new cutscenes to be had. There's just so much more they could do, and instead the killer is basically always the most obvious person in the world, and the revelations all just happen because the writers wanted to, not because the character motivation or context makes sense. Yeah. Like I said, I've, I've, I've stopped watching it myself. Honestly. Such a, that's such a boring one. Does it actually give you get them give get friendship though? I don't know. The Lucifer from Espion is way better than the Lucifer from the show Lucifer. So it's not bad, it's just they could do more, so it's disappointing. I guess that's how I feel about Twilight. I just kept expecting more when I was watching those films. I haven't read the books because apparently the books are worse than the films. But the people that the person, the woman that made Twilight had all of these, this whole world. She built this whole world and then she just made it weird. <laughs> yeah, her. I know her name. <laughs> the Farseer tells me that you've done well. Let's see if your observation and intuition is as strong with me. What will it be then? Do you want a potion that will turn the mare into a frog? <laughs> Nothing that advanced yet. See, it's the yet part that concerns me. I want a bottle of my favorite summer drink, Honey Mint Cooler. It's so refreshing on a hot day. You have a beehive, yes? Back home, I think this is violet. Simple syrup with honey and mint. But brewing it in your distillery gives it an extra kick. If you what are do you guys think? Completing my task, perhaps more witches will be willing to You think this themselves. is violet? She's, been, she's the one that told me to get the honey thingy. Back home, violet is from the island. Yeah. I think that sh this is this is Violet. <gasps> Welcome back, Keenan. Nobody's died. Twilight is fine. Eclipse is fine. Breaking Dawn is an absolute travesty of literature. New Moon. I rem I remember going with some friends to see the last um. The la I think it was the last Twilight film. And sorry if this is a spoiler for you guys because you know it's been a few years now. But there's this scene. That basically is amazing. It's really good. Has like severe consequences. Would have been like really quite uh, tragic. You know. Thing to happen. Interesting. And then it was all a dream. It was basically all a dream. Or the equivalent of a dream. And I hate that. <clears throat> yeah. I really hate that. I really hate it. So I was just like, oh yeah, she's actually finally done something crazy with this story. She's actually doing something good. And then, yeah. Yeah, the vision. The vision. Um, I feel like I've missed loads of chat. You're completely soaked because it's pouring outside. Oh, get yourself a towel. Get yourself next to some heat. Or, get, or better yet, get yourself a shower or something. And then at least it's purposefully wet <laughs> i love that this cult that just gives you tasks like i would like a cool mint drink please 
I don't know where the werewolf dude is. I think he's in over the bridge. I think he like lives over the bridge, but I don't know. The mink caller she said was based on something back home, but Violet is from here. I say it because he looks like the guy from that big bad wolf telltale game. Oh yeah, he does, doesn't he? Who even cares about Twilight, let's be honest. Nobody? Not anymore. <clears throat> Why do I know that? I don't want to know that. Because it's probably the most interesting thing that happens in the entirety of the four films. There's four films, right? I don't know. Exactly, Wintour's. There's five? Gosh. Don't even get me started on Renesme, by the way. There he is. <laughs> Heard you've been asked to help with the summer festival. Yes. Sophia asked me to fetch wood for the bonfire. Bale fire, you mean. Witches have been celebrating the solstice with bale fires for millennia. Non-witch folk came along, kept the custom, changed the name. So it goes. They only remember part of the legend. How does the coven celebrate the festival? Oh, we join in with the rest of the town at the bale fire. Our own traditions. We keep to ourselves. Say, you got any milk and honey? What for? Oh, is it another potion? You gotta learn your summer rites, novice. We leave offerings for the Fey folk every summer. It's tradition. Okay, well, honey, I can handle. But milk, I don't have a cow. The island will provide. Are you telling me to just search for a cow? Of course not. You might be able to strike a deal with the rancher who just moved in. Yeah, I did feel very, very deflated as soon as that it was a dream realization happened. I guess it was kind of the fact that that scene was genuinely, I don't know, in my opinion, I genuinely enjoyed it. I really, really found it really good. You know, it was a good fight scene. Everybody used their powers in really interesting, fun ways, you know, and worked it to get work together and Oh, oh, that actually didn't happen. What a shame. How boring. The only way it can work is if you set it up right at the beginning, like it's part of the story. Yeah, I think I agree. I, I think I can very strongly agree with that. When it becomes the out, it's like, oh, I couldn't commit, could you? Exactly. It's sort a of big disappointment. Right, so if I look into the journal here. Who is the person? Who is the person that we are looking for? Yeah, she's from here, isn't she? <clears throat> Yeah. Oh, Wesley is romanceable. So it's a woman. I don't think it's Sophia. For me, it's when a sequence has no impact on the story. It feels like it's stolen time from me. Like, if there's a time travel loop that deletes a load of events that's happened, give me the time back. I wasted watching all that stuff. Yeah. Also, me, when watching Shameless, I was like, where do I recognise this actor from? And until later find out he was in Twilight in that exact movie we were talking about. I'll sum up my point that Vanessa e looks like the evil witch from Once Upon a Time. Yes. Yes. I'm pretty convinced that Vanessa 
isn't a witch. But I don't know. Could it be Lena? No, she's from here. Him? Game Y, it would have been perfect. You know what else is deflating? A mirror. A mirror isn't from here. You think it's Sophia? I don't know. I think it's the cat. <laughs> I'm not confident either. My first instinct was Violet, but like you say, is there any... Talk to the Adept, maybe they'll drop a clue. Honey Mint Cooler. Oh gosh, gosh, gosh. We'll have to go and bug the Adept, see if we can get any more clues. Watch them during the day and they'll make references. Yes. I've been paying I haven't been paying enough attention because of work, so don't ask for my opinion. Don't worry. Um got some honey hopefully coming when these guys grow. Uh where's my distillery? My distillery's down here, isn't it? So Is it this thing? Yeah. So yeah, I need honey and mint. Where do I get mint from? Herb found in the mountain pass in summer and fall. Oh, this is not good. Um, I think the mountain pass is the bridge. So <clears throat> I think I need to fix the bridge, not that one, this one here. I think this is the mountain pass. So, yeah. Should I go to bed? Let's get the bed, the bed, the um, bridge <laughs> fixed. At the earliest convenience. Do you think Bruno is so depressed because his son is the mayor? Potentially. Do, 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 do. Just doing a really bad job of it. <laughs> Can't even say anything because I'd make him a bad father. What's the cotton got doing? Uh, four days. Boing. Right, let's uh try and focus on talking to Parker today. Make sure we have wait, do we have all the stuff? We don't. I probably I might have enough ingots though, actually. I've got a lot of iron ore. Don't know how. I don't know if that's enough. But we might be close. <gasps> it's the cat. Hi, cat. Hey there, kitty. Thank you. <laughs> now, Bruno's depressed because no one talks about him. Probably true. When are you open today? Okay, you you open at 9 a.m. We have time for errands. So just checking the notes board. Hello, Lena. Lena, the teenagers don't still jump over the bonfire at the summer festival, do they? No. I mean, Sebastian keeps threatening to build a skate ramp and do a flying trick over it. 
But I'm pretty sure Violet would confiscate his skateboard before he could. I think she's the high priestess. That would make sense, right? Because she's she's been here, like her, this is like her family island, and she like speaks about these being her ancestors. And Fairhaven is like where the witches come. So that kind of like eliminates her. In my opinion. When do you open? Are you open today? You also open at nine. Wow. Oh, let's see what's going on over here while I wait. Hello, Bruno. When I was a young man, I used to build the summer festival bonfire. <laughs> the young folks used to leap over the fire. Can you believe it? Not so much these days. <laughs> Can't say I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> We've got a cutscene to have with Sophia, but I have no idea where it would be. Honestly. I don't know where she hangs out, like where other than the diner. Hello, Vanessa. I'm never quite sure what to do with myself when school's out. Plan Otto's taxes, organize the closets again. Oh yeah. Move ahead on that kitchen renovation. You could take a real break. Just like your students. Oh no, I'd be terribly bored. Oh. No, not you. What? I want to talk to your husband. I mean, I don't, but... Enjoying summer vacation? Well, actually, uh, this is my busiest time at the farm, so... Ha! That's great. What a strange thing to say. She's just hanging around the school. What a strange person. Yeah, he wasn't a listening to a word I said, exactly. Angus. I wish it weren't such a pain getting to Fairhaven. I'd have my brothers visit all the time. Yeah, maybe I could get Francis's brother to visit, too. They could patch things up. I still don't know why Francis and Fabio don't talk, to be honest. Ooh. If I married him, I'd just live at my job, too. <laughs> do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Right, 9 a.m. Parker, you should be open. I need you to fix the bridge for me. Martin I'll say hi first. Nice enough, but his boots, they look like the kind you'd buy from some downtown boutique in the city. Not a rancher's boots, you know? Everyone has something to say about Marty, I swear. Right, uh, the mountain bridge. Oh, I need to go to... I need to, I think I need to go to your wife first. Apologies. Neom. Speeding across town. Hello, Natalia. I think I needed 14. I always get so excited for the summer festival. Ukrainians have cupola night, which is pretty similar. My neighborhood in the city was mostly Ukrainian. Every summer we did a dollar store version of cupola night in someone's backyard fire pit. Who doesn't like hanging out around a big fire? A dollar store? Does this exist? I thought the c currency of this island was gold coins. 
Ask permission from the wife, then show your wood to the husband. My god, Jade, you're nasty. Cat is a lifestyle. What? I'm I'm confused. Hello. Should only take a day or so. This is brilliant news. That means it takes two days. He's lazy. Uh, oh, I need to find Shelby and give him his bits and pieces. Wow, cat. Do my eyes deceive me? What a delightful surprise. Okay, I do get friendship for doing this. Looking forward to the summer festival, Shelby? It's a bit tamer than the summer festivities I remember from my boyhood. Less music and dancing. Oh, Shelby! I didn't know you danced. Oh, I can dance circles around any of you young folk. <laughs> okay, so, note to self, definitely do the community board stuff for people that you want to gain friendship with. So, <clears throat> what other construction stuff? We go on the go. I need more wood for the, the coop. But we can do that tomorrow. He left for those shops a lot, long time ago. He's back, Typhoon. I gave you one friendship. I took it from Keenan. <laughs> Is this some kind of long wind version of this friendship over with Keenan? Jade is my best friend. Jokes. He did leave a long time ago, but then he returned. Come get it, B. Oh! Whoa! Get it? I already took it and passed it around. Ah! Food much yum. Good. I'm always happy to hear food is much yum. Well, that was a long day. He meant to be open until five. He just left his post because he's got a job to do. Oh, I suppose that makes sense. I suppose he's going to head to do the the bridge. Uh, Angus... Uh, yeah, sure, let's accept that. I don't care about you, Vanessa. My, you, no. Not sure if you want that friendship, Jade. It sounds like it's gotten around, yeah. It's been around the block a few times, you know? Well, I'm looking at it right now, so you must have bought that one at Aldi or something. Oh, hello. You know the amount of quests I have right now. I'm getting the sense that Fairhaven's festival isn't just about the solstice. Is there a story behind it? Oh yes, there certainly is. Here, let's step outside and I'll explain. This is a statue of my ancestors, Peggy and Molly. They lived here during colonial times. Whoa. I knew your family had been here for a while, 
but I didn't realize just how long. One summer during the Revolutionary War, the British Navy demanded all of the town's stores. So the people of Fairhaven Wintel's all of their crops buys and friendship into wow. a storeroom ready for transport. The next morning, the soldiers opened the I have the no idea, Cap, but that's my theory. Storeroom. So they had to sail away empty-handed. Then Peggy and Molly led the mayor of Fairhaven to the lighthouse. And there it all was. The girls swore up and down that they'd prayed on it and a miracle had happened. To this day, we still don't know how they pulled it off. But we celebrate it, even if we don't understand. And here I thought this was just a statue. <laughs> oh no. It's rare that the things around us are just anything. What do you mean the Brits came and demanded things from you? We've never done that ever. <laughs> Vanessa was in charge of the summer festival last year. It was very classy and understated. That sounds festive. <laughs> Not at all. At least it rained and we didn't have to feel guilty about leaving early. old rancher, the guy who left ages ago, was super chill. He let me adopt one of his goats. I named her Pedro. <laughs> On the weekends, I'd feed her and play with her and stuff. Marty doesn't strike me as the kind of guy who'd let the kids do that. You think it's Sophia? Adopt adept. <laughs> hey, heard there's a new rancher. Marty's I think that's the hint. <laughs> Word travels fast in this town. Yeah, well, Thomas said something about one of Marty's sheep escaping and eating the lettuce that just sprouted in Thomas's garden. Oh no. This is going to go really well. I can already tell. Wonderful. While I'm here, my <clears throat> just buy. Casual 100. Oh, I do need some strawberry seeds, so I'll buy some of them. <clears throat> and then I think I already have loads of corn seeds. I can actually buy sugar. So I'll just buy sugar. Maybe not. I'll think about it. It's an option that we have. Right, flower has been purchased. Wait, what do I need the sugar for? Is it the... I've lost it. The lemonade. Amira next? Oh, I don't know where Amira is. I think her surgery was is closed, but I don't know. Yeah, it's not open on a Monday. I don't know where she is. Oh, I can I can I can I can Oh here's a poppy flower. There you go. Notice anything different, Grandma? I'm officially a patron of Violet's Boutique. Oh, she's so talented. Her fashions are as beautiful as her bouquets. That is... That has not yet happened in the game. We would be if Twitch didn't limit us to 2,000 a stream. That's right, Twitch. I'm calling you out. Where are we on? Where are we on? 72%. Oh. 36,000 to 50,000. I, uh... Yeah. I don't know. I might do it anyway, because I have bought stuff to do some bacon. <laughs> I've bought some stuff today. To do the bacon stoof. Near the lighthouse. <clears throat> I 
I may have done a Google and apparently she loves a bench. Just freaking loves a bench. Oh! Now that the ranch is open, Kim's business is thriving. I'm happy for them. We both come from families that set high standards for success. It can be a lot of pressure. There is anything different, Grandma? You're buried under six feet of dirt. Not the same as your old room now, is it, Grandma? I turned your room into a games room. There's a pool table in there. That's what I think of you, Grandma. Now you're not taking up space. I can finally have time to live life for me. Enjoy your dirt, Grandma. I'll enjoy my games. <laughs> That's so harsh. Not dropping hints like Shelby did, yeah. Uh, I don't know. At least that's what I assume she's thinking. <laughs> well, I left my best spade outside in the rain last week. Rookie mistake leads to rust. But when I went to get it, spade. the thing was propped up outside my door, dry as a bone. Oddest thing. Mm, maybe he isn't a wizard then, witch, whatever you call him. <clears throat> we just go wash him out. <laughs> no, <laughs> gasp. Until I was just spitting hot facts. Kind of annoying that that uh, voice line played when I have not yet unlocked the boutique. I don't even know how to unlock the boutique. I'm trying to avoid Google and stuff. But at the same time, kind of do want the good to be, do, do, do want the boutique, you know. <laughs> Hi Kai. Ah, oh, the water's finally warm! Well, as warm as it gets here. Back home, the water is warmer in winter than the water here is in summer. Doesn't that, like, blow your mind? Far out, man. Oh. <clears throat> Oh, hi, Francis. Oh, great. Now we have someone raising a bunch of animals nearby? Hey, what's wrong with animals? Nothing. It's just that my neighbor used to keep them. Odd. Quick, 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 quick. Woo, wind horse. Windhorse be working. Hey, can I strike a deal with you? I want some milk. Otto tells me you're also new to Fairhaven. Did the get back to the land bug bite you too? Well, not like it bit you. I mostly came to take care of my grandmother. Hazel, right? I heard that she passed away recently. My condolences. I know the animals are amazing, cat. Look at them. We're working towards getting a coop so we can have our own chickens. Uh, what should I do next? Should we go and spend some time in the mine? Look at those ears. I love how they're all babies. They are. They are just tiny little babies. Apart from the chickens. <clears throat> yep. Oh, there's Tucker. I might give him his... his wood. Here you go. Oh my stars above. <laughs> Oops. I'm channeling my mama, but I couldn't help it. This blew me away. I imagine feeling that excited because I gave five wood to him. But it, it puts that friendship up, so it's fine. 
He only gave me 12 gold for the for the privilege as well. Goodness. <laughs> when do we get the inheritance? <laughs> yeah, we already got the inheritance. She uh she left the house, the farm, everything to me. That's the inheritance. <laughs> she wasn't murdered. She died. She died of the big sea. She left. She left the house, the farm, and sixty-five thousand dollars in debt. Yeah. That's a lie, Your Honor. Collateral. Ugh. You know how there's like words of the day? Is there like a... Like an anti-word of the day? Because that is my... That is the anti-word of the day for me. Stupid, stupid word. assisted on aliving, right. <clears throat> yeah. I think I have enough ore to make some silver ingot. I think. What is this? Mine keys. Yeah, I think I do. That's good stuff. And complete one of the questios. How far the mines go down in this game? How many levels? I've got no like quest like telling me. <laughs> What I, what, how far I need to go to be the, considered the bottom. Oh heck, it's been an hour again already. Wow. But yeah, we're gonna come up onto um, an ad break in a second. When it pops up, I will go in to be right back. So, it's gonna, in the meantime, run and see if I can catch. Actually, let's check the journal. Not you. You. Are you going to be open? 5pm. Oh, I think I'll make it. Find levers again, why don't you? Wow, harsh. Well, yeah. All right, be right back. Welcome back, everyone. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> so I'm going to talk to Francis now. Maybe. I think he's down at the beach, though. I think I saw him down there, yeah. Was it better down there? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but considering we were playing sticky business, I don't know what the heck I'm referring to in that quote. Hopefully you enjoy my, my little bits of music that I put on in my breaks. All right, hello, Francis. Is this the kind of silver you need? Oh, Tara, this is perfect. I can't thank you enough. Just give me first look at the rings when you're done. They're going to be stunning. Yeah. By the way, have you ever heard of uh, creatures in the mine with pink hair and 
Embrace it's actually him. a really cozy huh? game, Mentos. You must have grabbed this silver off a gas fence or something. <laughs> yeah, that was probably it. Here, this is for you. Thanks so much. Wow. Sounds sussy though. Look it up on Steam. I promise you, it's not. I am very tempted to just buy the sugar. I think I'm gonna just buy the sugar, you know. Get me quickly to the middle of town! It's 4 p.m. Oh yeah, I remember it now. Yeah, you literally make stickers, yeah. There we go. And here you go. Here's the wooden sugar you asked for. You're the best. Thank you, Tara. You should come back to the town square on weekends. <laughs> oh yeah, you your reward doesn't go through. Oh. Come on, we gotta get started right away. We can't waste any more summer. On a Saturday or Sunday? Oh, I've got to wait for the whole week. Okay. I'm going to forget. I'm going to forget. Uh, okay, so ironing gots. We could get five ready for that. Do need milk. <clears throat> can I? Is there any way that I can purchase it off uh, the Marty guy? By the way, I wouldn't usually stay up this late to stream, but genuinely, Tom is waiting up to uh, to watch the state of play because of Final Fantasy. So, <clears throat> yeah. Oh, can I not buy? Uh, why can't I not buy? Freaking milk off you. Are you serious? Does bees wax come out of honey right away or do I have to make it a few times? I think when I... I I've only harvested honey once and I got... I think I got two beeswax and one honey. I don't even have any flowers right now. Ah, <laughs> oh, the stress. When are these gonna grow? Three days? Oh, one day for that. Okay, maybe I should have grown more marigolds. Hmm. <clears throat> Right, gotta get all stocked up for the the wood requirement we need for the coop. I honestly imagine not set not having I don't have either now I have a quest. Ah oh, the stress. Maybe I should build another beehive. I don't know what it requires. I think it's like 10 wood. Yeah. You put one there. Hope for, and then hope for the best. <laughs> I need this patch. Uh, I need the soil. 
So slow. So sad. Coop's gonna be over here. I'm hoping when, once I've finished uh, with the coop it'll give me the option to have like a full ranch and we can adopt some of the cowsies for ourselves. That would be very nice because I really do like them. They're so cute. We said hello to the cat today. Just in case we haven't. A cat. Aww, who's a good kitty? I think we had, but you know, you never know. Yeah, maybe I can pet them once I own them. Well, adopt them. Saying you own them feels a little bit weird for me. <laughs> The sun sets on another day. I'm gonna run over to the coven. The coven? Coven. 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 One of those words again. Like brazen. Coven. I think it's coven. Hello, Bruna. I'll need to come back tonight to harvest moonflowers. I'm waiting. <laughs> Typhoon's like having my own little... Is it... Is it linguistics? I don't think it is. I don't think that's the right word. But... A little tutor. Just... Yeah. Chilling. In my chat. I very much would like to open Violet's boutique so that I can change my clothes. Honestly, I, I would like that very much. I just have not unlocked the ability. Kiwi. If there's a right word for it, then I can't spell it. <laughs> probably not. I probably couldn't spell it either. Run, 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 run. I could be a pet pe while you run. Haha! -ha. Look at that. Right in front of my eyes. I need to come and question you. Does every witch here just accept the fact that seasons have to get turned, like mattresses? <laughs> no, not at all. It was hard for me to accept, too. What I learned is that places close to wellsprings are easily untethered from the realities of our world. For example, weather. Have you made my potion yet? No. I need a hint. Who are you? You really don't know? Surely those lovely eyes are more perceptive than you think. Hazel had this way of really seeing people, even when she first met them. I bet you do too. Is it just me or is that not a hint at all? Have you made my potion yet? No. I need a hint. Who are you? You really don't know? Is this- Surely those lovely eyes are more perceptive than you think. Hazel had this way of really seeing people, even when she first met them. I bet you do too. What the heck? 
does that mean? Maybe talking to the others, we can help, like, eliminate. We should update the coven offerings from just milk and honey, you know? It's just not very 21st century. Maybe we should try offering hoverboards or a gamer chair. Is that Damon or Kai? Thanks, Shane. No, no, no. I wanna, I want, kind of want to work it out myself. I'm pretty sure that's Lena. And then, and then, who's this? One time, I messed up my proportions when I was making a big bat of Miracle Grow. I tested it on a mushroom, and it exploded to like ten times its original size. <laughs> I think what that's Violet. Do? I stuffed the mushroom in my bag and took it home. Duh. Fresh produce is expensive. I think that's Violet. And if that's Damon or Kai, and that's Lena. Sophia? Just look at the look at the look at the people again. And this is the mirror. I think a mirror is a witch. Uh. Is that everybody? I can't remember. Talk to you. Who are you really? Persist in your studies with the coven and you will know one day. Yeah, I feel like you're Lena. I'm feeling Lena vibes with you. Oh! You're like the hardest one. Something to do with eyes. I think Amira has been more flirty with talking about your eyes, yeah. I think we're gonna guess Amira. I think it has to be Amira, because I feel like Amira is a witch, you know? She's in the woods a lot, you know? Let's just re let's read her description quickly about what we know about her. Maybe the most magnetic person to ever walk this island. The two by the cauldron were the hardest, yeah. Is there a journal entry for the quest? It just says maybe they'll drop a clue. Oh, big thanks. Let's hop into bed. See what the new day brings. Is it time for bed? Yes. <sighs> oh. Well, the mountain bridge is repaired. <laughs> I got an achievement for it. I looked this one up on Google because so I didn't want to remake the potion and wait another day. I think if I get that desperate, I probably will. Because I'm really, d I don't know, I'm really not that confident. Oh, it's raining. This is wonderful news. <gasps> are they ready? I think they are. So now my bees should be producing. Haha, -ha, look at that. Hopefully. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Got mail. A new neighbor has moved in. I'm gonna sneeze. I'm really fast on this button tonight. Gosh, right. 
As a former new arrival, I thought you would show her the way. Yes, I'll show her the way. Oh, God, most needs. Once I figure out how to get there myself. Goodness gracious, right. I think first priority today is going to check out over the bridge because we need mint. As well as the honey we're making to make the honey mint cooler. I'd say if there's a low confidence and a long lead time in the potion, we decide who we think, then look it up to check. I think that is a fabulous idea. Here we go. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing type of thing. <laughs> I was like, damn. It's a shame it's raining. <laughs> Is this mint? No. Nigella. I think that's how you say that word. I have no idea. Never heard it outside out, out loud before. Oh look, ma the map is cleared away. Hot springs, blackberries. <clears throat> What's up here? This kind of looks minty, no? What a strange non view. In that left area, there seems to be hot springs. In this area? Hello. Hi, I'm Tara Wild. I own the farm down the mountain path. Are you the new scientist? Oh, I think I saw your farm on my way in. Oh. It's charming. I'm Giva Joshi, and yes, I'm a meteorologist. I love her earrings. I'm study the funny weather patterns you have here in Fairhaven. Oh, is our weather that strange? It seems pretty normal to me. Really? Well, I understand you're having a reduced rainfall compared to other areas in the region. Unusual for this time of year. Well. In any case, your mayor told me you might show me the way to town. <laughs> Absolutely! Uh, follow me. This is the blacksmith run by Natalia. Wait, like an actual village blacksmith? Oh, how quaint! I know, right, Sophie? Oh, she could make me copper wiring for a new antenna. And here we are! The town hall. Oh, you must be Giva! I'm Mayor Otto Soft. Thanks Giba. for bringing her by, Tara. We have a little oh, game we play with all new arrivals in Fairhaven. Hello. Introduce you yourself no, to they're all yours. Your neighbors, I ate loads. And they'll oh, let me know okay. when you've met everyone. <laughs> You're a riot. Actually, oh, yes, please. Yes. Oh. oh, no. Wait. Really? Yes! Sorry for and the Persona 3 the music then. If you heard it, I don't settled. know. Oh, you've already met Tara. So that's one down. Um, okay, why not? Should be good for a laugh, right? This island may be stranger than I thought. Uh, what was that? Oh, nothing. Wait, is she romanceable too? Got a lot of hearts. Maybe she is. I don't know what that cutscene was about because somebody gave me like a little rundown as <laughs> Tom came in. <laughs> and gave me prawn crackers. Crunch. Ah, okay. Do 
didn't appreciate it teleporting me into town when I wanted to explore the new area. Was this mint? Aha! Who lives here then? Oh right, she lives there. Wait. Oh, to the left here. Oh yeah, there's like hot springs here. I don't think I can do anything, but... They look hot. And they are springs. So, you own this big ass building here, as well as the little hut down there. She shoots Wednesday to Friday, wow. Well, I was hoping to find a little bit more mint. Anybody see any that I missed? <laughs> it is her workplace, it is, but you know. I was excited, I thought that maybe, just maybe, we had found where Wesley lives. Well, can't see any mint, so we'll crack on. Wesley lives in your heart. seen him. Daily love for the cat. Hey there, kitty. The cat gave me a bone. Somehow that doesn't feel quite right. Doesn't Wesley live on the other island? Oh, well, milk water. Maybe. He doesn't seem certain about it. In the notes it doesn't seem very certain. <clears throat> right, so working on that. You need to do that actually. Let's get five. Let's get some more iron ingots. Oh, I haven't chatted with you actually. On the dating apps, I have you talked to everyone in town today? Oh, I haven't. Water. Haven't. But when I say I live in Fairhaven, they stop messaging me. Come on, the fairy's not so bad. Sometimes the captain lets you toot the horn. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Chat with Angus. 
Some days I freak out about following Francis to Fairhaven. Like, was it a bad life decision? But then there are days like today. I can leave the door open, listen to the rain, and wait for my dough to proof. And I'm like, bet she does typhoon. This is perfect. See what Violet has to say today. Hey, if you see Sebastian outside, will you remind him not to skate in the rain? Last time he did that, he ate dirt and sprained his ankle. Yeah. So that other witch sounds so much like Violet. It has to be her. I don't know if... If Kai is the witch in the corner or if Damon is. Could it be Kim? I don't think he could be. Hey, did, did I hear you singing just now? Look, it gets lonely in here sometimes. I gotta keep myself entertained. You should try it on the farm. No. I don't think so. Let's go and chat with Amira. Have you met the new meteorologist yet? It's nice to meet someone else who geeks out over data and peer-reviewed studies. Even if hers are about hurricane patterns and mine are about flu statistics. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. <laughs> Hear you talk again. Hey, that new meteorologist is kind of cute, yeah? Don't think I'm her type, though. It's so hot that everyone is ordering milkshakes. I take pride in making them the old-fashioned way with hand-scooped ice cream. But, ow, my right bicep is really sore. And Giacomo used to say I could beat him at arm wrestling in the summer. Yeah, I don't think it's... I don't think it's Sophia. Ooh. Summer fishing is a big tourist thing in Milkwater, right? Ever thought of moving? <sighs> thought about it, sure. But, nah. I can't stand the kind of tourists that come to Milkwater. So fancy. At least folks here know how to behave. Let's make sure we chat in with everybody. Hey, Akai. You making anything for the summer festival? <laughs> no way. Which is better for everyone, trust me. Damon had to put a sign above his stove that says, Kai, don't walk away if the burner is lit. Hmm, very interesting, very interesting. I don't know who the... Hello? Hello? So, what's milk water like? Uh... Pleasant. Pleasant. Yep. Wow. Wow. What a guy. Helpful indeed. He doesn't really live in milk water, does he? Oh, hello, Francis. Very deep lore. Hi, Francis. Looking for pearls? I was, but I guess I got lost in thought watching the waves. The water here is much colder, but the waves lives under your stairs, probably. Of La Isla. Not that I even got to visit it much. Growing up, I didn't really feel at home on La Isla, but I didn't really feel at home in the city either. Do, do you feel at home here in Fairhaven yet? Uh, home is people. I think that home is less about a place than it is about the people you are with. Being with loved ones matters the most to me. That's part of my problem, I guess. When I left the city, I left my family behind. Now it's just me and Angus. Oh, listen to me. I'm just babbling out loud. Thanks for listening, Tara. Casual friends. Hell yeah. 
That's my problem. I just hate everyone. <laughs> Do any of the ladies wear glasses? Uh, Cameron wears glasses. Francis wears glasses. Jeeva wears glasses. Nah. Is there... Wh I just don't know. <laughs> Nothing down here today. I'm gonna go and talk to Marty, but simply because I want, I'm hoping that he lets me buy milk at some point. Oh, I need to go and find Tucker. Uh, not Tucker. Parker. I don't know why I always think his name's Tucker. Hello. You know what's worse than getting your socks soaked out in the fields? What? It was an honest question. I can't think of anything worse. Relatable, truly. Really. Can I jump over this fence? Can. Oh, I'm epic. Hello. Oh, we've had it for, uh, huh. I'm just realizing I don't know. Did I accidentally Long skip story, some uh, dialogue there? Out. I'm still learning a ton about this place. Well, that farmhouse is a stunner. Great bones. Thanks. Weird comment. Oh. Uh. I agree, actually. I don't know what just happened in that dialogue. I, I think I accidentally skipped a line of dialogue, maybe. Or maybe he asked me a question. I don't know. I don't know what I've been told, literally. Do, do, do. Head over to Tucker's workshop really quickly. See if we can get this coop on the way. Eh? We'll be able to fix up this coop, no problem. But you'll need to clear out all the trees oh. and rocks from the area I've roped off. Are you serious? Now, you come back and let me know when you've cleared out all the trees and rocks there, and then we can talk business. Then we can talk business. Me, 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 me. Do you have to make anything for the summer festival? Uh, I used to, but I tapped out of summer festival prep a few years back. Don't tell Lena, but the festival creeps me out. <laughs> well, at least I can pop past my home and make a load of fish fingers. That out of context is a brilliant, brilliant sentence, actually. Fish fingers for days. All right, let's clear out this area. <clears throat> I'm hoping to get the coop done today. Hello. I didn't. I thought that because you're staying up, I might as well just carry on for a bit. Are you excited? An hour. An hour to go. Thank you. Do 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 do. Finally. 
There we go. Whoa! What's this? A recipe? What's it? A recipe for now? A, a lobster roll, but it just doesn't make any sense to me. Just like recipes, just chilling rocks. Do 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 do. Probably need to get rid of this rock too. And then this tree just for good stuff. Just to make sure. Right, off we go back. Oh, thank you for the stretch journey. I will do that now. You can't see it, but I promise you, I am stretching. All right, Tucker, you happy now? Tucker, Parker, honestly. Bam. Okay, I'll get started fixing up that old coop right away. Should only take a day or so. Should only take a day or so. Always does, doesn't it? Always does. In the meantime, I will make back my my money through the form of fish fingers. Profit. Hey Bruno, still open? Give me, give me. 100 of your best tuna. And then... I'm desperate to know who this witch is. I can't actually do any guesses until I've made the... Ah, oh, you sure have been keeping Parker busy. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh no, I don't mind. Sorry, he loves got distracted. The little Stream of brains. on old houses. If it was up to him, we'd go off island to hit up antique markets every weekend. Yeah, I need I need to have the uh the thing on me to actually give it to someone. And I haven't got mint or honey. <laughs> so Desperately trying to get that, that level up. So we can unlock all the things. Alright. Yeah, we'll wait till tonight and see if we can go and get a... Uh... I haven't got enough bananas, Typhoon. I've sold them all. You're about to tell me that, sh that, that Lena sells bananas, aren't you? I don't... Does it have a time limit on it? No. So it's fine. I think I've already checked the beach today, so... <laughs> but we'll do it, damn it. We'll do it. <laughs> I spoke with you today. 
Yeah. Bye. You sell bananas. It does not look like she does. Sells literally every fruit, but if we had the level unlock, but she does have milk. Wow. Oh, honestly. <laughs> Are you telling me I actually need two honeys? Oh my goodness. I do, I do. I don't know if I'm going to get enough honey. There's just so many things that I need. And so little time. They're not producing honey because it's raining. I don't even know. Oh, does this, it's gonna, I don't know. Haha! -ha! Okay. And I needed corn as well. Might as well use my potions. I forgot I had these. Well, at least maybe might be in with a chance of in some honey. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I don't think I am. Oh, this is a, this is a disaster. What are these? Are these marigolds? I think they are. How do I make miracle potion? Give me the the recipe. Toadstools and soils. I don't want to spend my soils. I need my soils. Oh, this is just horrible. I hate this. I hate it. I actually love it, but I also hate it. <laughs> All right, so he's doing this. Well, at least I thought he would be. We got other stuff going strong. I mean, I think if we do get one honey, I think we should prioritize this because I think this isn't this isn't like something that we need to do straight away. We're planting cotton. Okay, I feel like everything's in the right place. Just gonna go and quickly do some some mining. Let's see if we can get some more levels in the bag, and then I think I'm gonna start looking at wrapping up the stream today.
So glad I got the shovel to be able to literally get clay. I don't, I don't think I've ever needed clay until now. You've been streaming for so long already. That sounds like a complaint. Wow. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't, maybe I should just stop right now. I'll need to go as, as it will soon be bedtime. Good night. Good night, Keenan. Have good times. Sleep wells. Uh, what am I looking at? What am I actually looking at? I'm, I'm meant to be looking in my inventory. That's what I'm supposed to be looking at here. Clay. It's a useful crafting ingredient. So you say. Well, exactly my point. I also need the slaps. I'm, I, I'm sorry. Uh, the game's, you know, addic addicting. Well, how about we, we set the day speed to normal and start heading over to the coven. Hopefully by the time we get there, it'll be dark and then we'll get the hint. Hopefully a new hint. And then we will. Yeah. Just be awesome. We'll know it. We'll know it straight away. We hope. Kids on the phones these days. Right. It is going dark now. Perfectly timed. Couldn't have done it better. Right. Let's see. Do you want to pick that up? <laughs> right. Any more hints? It's just going to be the same one. Pretty sure. We can try. It took me ages to get this far in the coven. But don't give up. You'll get the hang of it. You're the acolyte. You're not the person I am seeking. The first seer's advice may seem unclear. But if you really listen, everything he says makes sense in the end. Have you made my potion yet? No. I need a hint. Who are you? You really don't know? Ugh. Surely those lovely ah. eyes are more perceptive than you think. Hazel had this way of really seeing you. Nah. No. Disgusting. Hate it. No new hints for us. I think my guess is a mirror. Just based on voice alone. Voice and vibes. I want to look it up too. Should we do it? Shall we? I don't know. You're not? Okay. Oh, I'm going to put Tara to bed. I'm going to put Tara to bed and then we will continue guessing. Take a chance, solve a mystery. I will certainly try. I, uh... I'll wait until, like, right before we get a, uh... Get the po actually get the thing that we need to give to her. So we need to, like, make this first. Which I think we're quite a while away from, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, so... Yeah. Time for bed. It was the adept, right? Yeah. So, don't tell me, Typhoon. We'll wait until we're about just about to get the, give the honey mints to someone. I have the tab open, but I've not read it yet. Oh, right. 